Hey everybody, this is the uh, tutorial for Three Little Birds and um, I'm gonna be playing it off the paper instead of with the play along. Um, the chords you need to know, your basic ones, well, before you even get to the chords, let's make sure that you're in tune. So you'll play your go count each ape. And the chords that we need to know to play Three Little Birds are three of our four basic chords, C, you need to be able to play F, and you also need to be able to play G. Three Little Birds will have a short introduction. We're going to strum the C chord eight times. After that, we will go A, B, A, B, and then there's also a short coda where you're going to go between the F chord and the C chord eight times, and we'll repeat it. The A section, you just strum the C chord 16 times, you strum the F chord eight times back to eight Cs, and you repeat it. So that section is not too tricky. The B section is the one that's a little more challenging, and that's what I wanna work with you guys on right now. So the chords for the B section, I'm gonna play through them first just so you can hear them. We're gonna strum the C chord eight times. And then we're gonna strum the G chord eight times. We're gonna go back to the C chord. And then we're gonna go to the F chord. Going back to C, everything will be strummed eight times. To the G chord. Then we're gonna go to the F chord. to C. So what I'd like to do now is I'm going to strum four C chords. You're going to strum them back. I'm going to strum four G. I'll strum them back. Four C. I'll strum them back. Four F. I'll strum them back. Let's go through the entire section. You guys will echo me. So C chord first. Be first. Give it a try. G chords next. Give it a try, back to C, give it a try, here's the F, ready, go, back to C, your turn, here's the G chord, your turn, back to F, your turn, back to C. Your turn, and you're done. This time, I'd like to play two strums on each chord. So we'll start with two Cs, me first and you. Play the C, G, G, your turn. C, C, your turn. F, F, your turn. C, C, your turn. G, G, your turn. F, F, your turn. C, C, your turn. So now what I want you to try is we're gonna slowly strum through each chord one time. That way you can get a feel for the transitions. So let's go C. Now just to the G chord. We're going to go back to C. Let's try going to F. We're going to go back to C now. We're going to go to the G chord. Back to F. And then we're going to go to the C chord. This time, let's try to play each chord with eight strums. One, two, C chord go. Here's our G chord now. Here's 
the C chord. Here's the F. C. Here's the G. to the C. We're going to perform this one without the track. So the only thing that we're going to add to the beginning are eight strums on the C chord as our introduction. Um, you may have noticed that I forgot to put some of the F chords on the um, B section, so I wrote mine in, but you'll probably just be able to play it by ear. So the song is in uh, A, B, A, B, A form with the coda. We repeat the A section at the end. If you play it the way you see it on your papers, you'll be good to go. And remember, we're going to be performing it like this, not with the track. So here's the entire song. It's gonna be all right. Don't worry about a thing. Cause every little thing is gonna be all right. Here's the B section. Rise up this morning. Smile with the rising sun Three little birds Perched on my doorstep Sing a sweet song A melody pure and true Singing This is my message to you Hey. 
every little thing is gonna be alright.